Well, the Indians held their second annual Puppy Palooza tonight. Over 500 dogs brought their owners for a night of fun and fellowship to the ballpark. News Channel 5's Rich Geyser was there to check out the mood. They came dressed in their best team gear. Many only came to make new friends. The $30 package had one ticket for the dog and one for the owner. Excited dogs waited while the paperwork was checked. The fun started right away with a belly rub and a quick kiss. Everyone was excited to be here. Hanging out with my dog at the Indians game. My two, my two loves, man. And we brought Grady and Phineas to the park to watch baseball. They're huge fans. We'll see a little bit of baseball, see a couple other dogs, and uh, show off our little dog. Olivia came all the way from California. We love it. This is a great event. Sydney is back for his second year. Oh, she loved it. She loved the parade. She loved all the socialization. There was a bit of trash talk before the game. Brutus took a quick drink and it's off to the big parade. Time to strut around and get noticed. All 518 dogs marched the warning track prior to the game. Bailey brought Slider along and helped to greet the kids. Danielle from the Indians front office helped put this together. She knows what the dogs think. Take a look for yourself. If dogs could smile, they're doing it right now. Shadow got to his seat early and thanked his owner for bringing him. Doc couldn't wait for a hot dog. Philip passed on the hot dog for some of his owner's sub. Junior prefers to eat the whole peanut and then spit out the shells. Now I know what you're thinking, and the Indians took care of that with this special grassy relief station. It was a great night, even with the final score. Rich Geyser, News Channel 5. And a portion of the proceeds from tonight's puppy Palooza benefits the 16,000 animals that go through the Cleveland APL yearly.